number 14, Jack Moore. And here was the key to this ball club. Jackie Moore, 5'9", senior. Jack Moore was a small, agile court tactician whose outside skills surprised opponents and fans at the 1978 Final Four as he led Muncie Central to a state championship. Bridges. Here's Jack Moore. He got his man of the air, goes around and takes it home. He was great inside, too. When the little guy gets that ball, you can't keep from fouling him. That's all. He's going to make you foul him. He is just about as good as anyone I've seen at doing that. There he is, Jack Moore, 5'9", senior with a 21-1 scoring average. Leads the team in assists and steals. Jack Moore scored 34 points in the first round game and 27 in a thrilling overtime title win over Terre Haute South Vigo High School. His strong but small frame was ideal for athletics in general, but he may well have seemed simply too small to be a standout in Division I basketball. But fans of the University of Nebraska were the next to be made believers in Jack's energetic style of play. Jack enrolled at the football-obsessed Lincoln, Nebraska campus, quickly becoming a crowd favorite using the same finesse and daring that wowed Final Four fans in Indiana. He won the 1982 Pomeroy Naismith Award for the nation's best senior player under six feet tall. And he won admirers throughout his four years as a Cornhusker for his positive personality and his straight A academic record. Jack adopted Nebraska as his new home state. And after graduating, he was in the early years of a business career there, but it all came to a tragic end for Jack Moore on the back portion of a Nebraska ranch on a stormy night. He and his business partner, stockbroker Gary Johnson of North Platte, died when their private plane crashed on March 3rd, 1984. Johnson was piloting the plane on a return business trip from Indiana, where the two had also watched Jack Moore's former high school team play. They landed to refuel in Des Moines, Iowa, then ran into unexpected storms and fog over Nebraska before crashing. 25 years after their deaths, the University of Nebraska campus saluted their popular hoops and easygoing role model with Jack Moore Day coinciding with a Cornhusker basketball home game. Halftime featured appearances by Jack Moore's mother and his sisters, one of whom, Jane Ann Giles, said she still kept a small piece of the plane in which her brother had died as a memento. She said it gave her consolation. Jerry Shoecraft was a childhood friend and teammate of Jack Moore's on the 78 state title team. Jerry Shoecraft. Shoecraft, a leaper, 6'5", a senior. He said it was Jack Moore who persuaded him to enroll at Nebraska and play for the Cornhuskers. Shoecraft, who would go on to serve two terms on the Lincoln City Council and have a business career in the community, said Jack Moore has inspired him in everything he has accomplished. Jerry said on a Cornhusker website that whenever he's feeling low or facing adversity, he asks himself the same question, what would Jack do?